Hi guys and welcome back to EBW Cards with a very different video today. This is your captain speaking and in front of us we have the three secret rare EX legendary birds from Fire Red and Leaf Green, a set released all the way back in 2004. Now the reason for this video today is to basically show what we're going to be doing with all one of these cards and the reason why. So first of all, before I get into showing off any of the cards, uh, I'd like to introduce you to Josh at Collectibles. So Josh is an incredibly nice guy. We had so much fun with him meeting up at the London Card Show a little while back, probably getting on for a year ago now, which is crazy. And uh, yeah, he introduced us to his mirror coat cleaning products and uh, yeah, we just had an incredible time cracking some packs and, and talking about the hobby in general. And me and him came up with an idea. Um, I received these cards recently uh, from eBay, just buying them as singles as I've been trying to do a lot more recently. And I've noticed that while they're all in really, really nice condition, um, me with my OCD means I must have the best condition I can get my hands on at the best possible price, but without grading, because I'm really not a massive fan of, of grading. I used to be. Used to, but then I found myself getting caught up and hung up on what grades everything was, and really just you know not enjoying the cards for what they were, which is which is what I think the hobby's lost sight of nowadays. You know, just sticking the cards in a binder and having a good look through and enjoying them. But anyway, anyway whatever floats your boat. But the one thing I did notice is if we look at these three cards here, and we'll take a look at them in closer detail in a minute, the Moltres just doesn't look like it pops like the other two do. Now, bearing in mind these cards, let's get a closer look at them. So we'll look at something where, we'll look at the Arts Cuneo, where I know that is in very decent shape. So these cards just pop. They are secret rares from the Fire Red and Leaf Green set. As you can see, they're 114 out of 112. These cards just have this cracked ice effect on them. They pop really well. And it may be just the colors on the Arts Cuneo and the Zapdos, but they just seem to have a, a lot of an edge over the um, Ultra, so that's the answer you know there. We have the Zapdos as well. I'm not gonna take these out of the sleeves. Uh, obviously that would give us a little bit of a better look, but it really does, you know, th these cards look so clean in their sleeves anyway, uh, which I'm hoping. Now when I show you the Moltres, it just doesn't, it has a sort of dullness to it. I'm not I'm not sure, it may be, it may be the colors, but if we, and I say apologies, I don't have any gloves on, um, but, and I'm sure Josh will clean up anything here. There's there's just a sort of dullness to the card, and it just doesn't pop like the other two does. And I will put up some pictures on the screen as well of what I took, um, trying to get these basically to show me. But they're, they're just there's just something about this Maltrez card that I think could benefit for some treatment by by Josh. So that's what we're gonna do. So we'll get this back in the sleeve. Nice and carefully. We'll also get it in a top loader. And we'll zoom the camera out a bit here. So, whenever you're sending cards, this is what you should do. Uh, top loader, card saver, anything, uh, anything along those lines. Make sure that's in there. A nice tap. There we go. The card is uh, the card is protected for its journey. As you can see as well, look, it's so clean on the back. Uh, it's just some crap on the top loader, but this one I mean that this could be a really really nice mint card for the collection. And also, if you're ever going to put any, if you're send any cards by by post or whatever, it should always go in its own team bag. So the card is not going to go anywhere. Slide out the top loader on its uh, on its adventures. Really hard to do looking at the camera, but there you go. So that's sealed up. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get this packed up and sent over to Josh. Uh, we'll put some more details about his uh, about his page and business over the next few minutes, and then uh, we'll come back for hopefully what we see as some results. Catch you soon. Something I'm always being asked here at Collectibles is what is the predominant use for mirror coat, and the answer put simply is yes. We built Miracle to be as versatile as possible. So yes, it works great on binders to get rid of those greasy fingerprint stains. Yes, it works fabulously on display cases to give them that extra UV protection. And yes, it works wonders on figurines to give them that anti-static coating to prevent dust from building up. 
But don't just stop at your collectibles. Miracoat works great on TV, laptops, and phone screens, work surfaces, shelves, and mirrors, or even in your bathroom to get rid of those pesky water stains on your sink. Miracoat really is as wonderful as we make it out to be. So don't just stop at your collectibles. Get your entire house sparkling with our lovely Miracoat. Have yourselves a great day. So as you've just seen guys, Josh did an amazing job with that it's a cheeky before and after shot of the Moltres and uh, today it has arrived back, he's even addressed it to the captain which is very very cool so let's open it up and let's uh, see Moltres in all his or her or their new glory. purple packaging of course there you go this Moltres shines almost as brightly as you now lots of love Josh what a legend definitely one of the best guys in this hobby if you haven't already uh, go and uh, go and follow him on all the socials and uh, and check out the Oxford card show which is running next year he's going to be hosting that and uh, we'll certainly be going so let's have a look and there you go Shines a lot nicer now, as we saw in the video. It's done a smashing job. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Go check out Collectibles, and uh, yeah, thank you for keeping ABW.